Hello everyone, today we're going to show you how to use and create a two-step URL for Amazon. This URL targets specific keywords when sending customers to Amazon by restricting products by brand and keyword. We can use an AC number and a price to narrow down the list. With that being said, let's create one. The first thing that we will do is give a name to our link. We're going with coffee machine today. In the configuration section, we will first select the marketplace, which in our case is the United States. After that, we will have to add the specific brand of our product. Keep in mind that this field is case sensitive, so we recommend you just copy and paste it from the marketplace. You can find it right here. I'm taking it from this place. After that, we will add our keyword. In this type of link, we can only add one keyword for ranking. We're going with coffee maker. Next, we will add the AC number taken directly from the marketplace. You can also add your Amazon attribution slot or Amazon attribution tag in this section. And finally, you can enter a price minimum and price maximum for your product. Since my product is $37.56, I'm adding a $36 as a minimum and as a maximum at $38. In the next section, you can add a tracking code, add your link to one of your campaigns, use a custom subdomain if you have one available, and toggle on or off these options for further link customization. You can also activate the link expiration settings for when your link expires. And finally, add the information for your social media thumbnail. When everything is set, simply click on Generate Tracking Link. And here we have our two-step URL. Remember that you can edit the back half of the link so it can mention your product or brand, download a QR code that leads to your link, and edit the settings if you want to change something. Now when we click our link, you can see that the filters we added to our link have been applied for the brand, price, and keyword. And that should do it for today. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.